Hey guys, here's a quick look at how to find a citation when you're in a ProQuest database uh, so that you can paste it into Noodle Tools. <clears throat> so the public library subscribes to a lot of databases owned by the ProQuest company. So if you're on their page and you go to their research databases, you'll see it under magazine and newspaper. And if you click on the P, you'll see that they subscribe to quite a lot of different ProQuest databases. You're also very likely to stumble on them when you're on the library page for Marymont <clears throat> under Blackboard. If you click on databases over here, I have included links to ProQuest databases in a lot of these categories. Um, you can see ProQuest, 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 ProQuest. So for demonstration purposes, I'm just going to go to the main ProQuest, which is it searches all the different databases at once. Um, and that includes journals and videos and dissertations, all kinds of cool things. Uh, I'm going to put in my search terms at home. It'll probably ask you all for your library card number, so you'll have to put that in there. All right, so my search results are here. I'm going to limit it to full text. I only want articles that uh, include the article for what I'm doing right now. And then when I find an article I want, I select it. <clears throat> the citation will be over here under Cite on the right. And be careful that you're picking the right citation style for your paper. My paper is using MLA style, specifically MLA 8th edition. And I need to click change or that change does not take place. Right, so now I have an MLA styled one. One way you'll know that this is correct is uh, APA uses last name, comma, first initial, and MLA uses the full first name. That's one of the giveaways of MLA versus APA. I'm going to copy that and head on over to Noodle Tools. Ooh, where did my Noodle Tools go? No big deal. I'll just sign back in. Radio, there's my project. I'm going to head over to sources, create new citation. ProQuest is a database. Ooh, what kind of source do I have? I probably better go back over there and take a look. So, what I'm going to look for is the italicized phrase that tells me where the source is. So Toronto Star. If you didn't know what that was, you could Google it, but when I see the word star, I'm usually gonna assume that's a newspaper because that's a pretty common name for a newspaper. So I'm going back over to Noodle Tools and I'm gonna click Newspaper. And then I'm gonna do Copy and Paste Citation. Stick that in there. I don't see any all caps, my italics stayed italicized so i'm going to click save and i'm all set 